Meteorologist Jonathan Stacy joins me as we're watching the haze there, Jonathan. We're also going to be watching the heat in the coming days. Yeah, only to add insult to injury, David, we're also dealing with increasing temperatures. And if you already thought it was hot, Thank you. well, you haven't felt anything yet. And that will be under a heat dome as we get deeper into the week. Right now, temperatures across the desert southwest are in the digits is all brought to us by this heat dome. That heat dome will move further to the east. And with that being said, that sinking air will allow temperatures to warm up dramatically. By contrast, an area of low pressure causes the air to rise. That gives you clouds and even precipitation with sinking air on the backs of high pressure. That means that clouds are really hard to come by, allowing the sun's direct rays to slam into earth and warm things up. How warm will we get by Tuesday afternoon? 96 degrees, 90 seven by Wednesday. Yes, a bit of a heat wave, if you will. By our standards, this is considered a heat wave. Two days of abnormally warm temperatures. Yes, normal for this time of the year, 90 degrees. In fact, the warmest day of the year so far, July 1st, we hit 96 degrees, 99. We did that back in the middle of June of last year. Tom, it's been about four years since we found temperatures in Atlanta in the triple digits. Hopefully we don't press the gas too much. Oof, it is sweltering out there. All right, Jonathan, thanks for the perspective.